for the women's 100 meter final. Who will be the star here for the women over 100 meters? Set. And a fair start on this women's 100. And Kellyanne Frazier got away well there. But now here's Karan Stewart beginning to pull away in the center of the track. Karan Stewart doing what she's done all season long, winning in 10.75. 10.75. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Wow. 10.75. That's number five all time. That She is the fifth fastest woman of all time now, Lewis. I expected a fast race here today, but that is otherworldly. She is shot herself. The face says that I cannot believe the performance. 10.75 seconds, and this really has to lean on the fact that we're running on Mondo, and the weather is right around 80 degrees. It's warm. No wind because of this humongous stadium. And Karan Stewart comes to Rome and drops one of the best times ever over 100 meters. The fifth fastest ever, and it's because she got a good start. We knew Shelly Ann Fraser in the headband was going to get a good start. But as I said, striking distance. Now that 200-meter strength comes out, and this was not close. She is pulling away from everyone in this field and takes a little bit off at the end right there, Lewis, and still runs 10.75. I had said earlier, Jetta was looking like the favorite for Berlin. Not anymore, but of course, there's still a lot of time. Jetter's already beat Stewart for the year, but after this performance, I don't see how anyone is going to surpass her as the favorite for Berlin now. So Karan Stewart comes to Rome and runs the fifth bestest time ever over 100 meters. She drops Shelly Ann Fraser, Carmelita Jenner, and now really makes herself the favorite leading to the world championships.